Bird Park. Doing well. How are you doing? Just fine. How are you? <sighs> Having a good morning. Well, that's a good way to start it's the a, day. It's a beautiful Friday. Oh yeah. So yeah. 71 Suburban. So what were you doing at 71? So in 71, I was hanging out in Grand Rapids, Michigan, in my mother's womb. Uh, because I was born in 72. There you go. There you go. Yeah. So I mean, you're a Michigander. You 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 were in the big born city of New York, York, and then came yeah. back uh, back home in a way. I did. I did. It's been great. It's been two years. Uh, you know, it was um, a great move. I mean, it was based on Wayne State and Detroit, both of which were really attractive to us. We worked 20 years on the East Coast. Wow. 16 in New York City. Wow. So that's amazing. Yeah. Leadership is key. Leadership is important. And uh, you have just gone gangbusters. I mean, I knew you were going to be good, but I didn't know you were going to be good because you have really done a lot of things that I think are just what the university needs, not only for the law school, but actually kind of role models for the rest of the university. Well, I appreciate that, but as you say, it's a team effort. Uh, it's um, the faculty, the students, support from the administration, the alums, everybody's pitched I support in. You? So it's, you know, you don't get in my way anyway. Oh, okay. <laughs> that, that's that's <laughs> that, what I try to do, yeah, not yeah, to get in yeah, the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So it's been, it's been a really um, satisfying and productive couple of years. What's been the best part of it? The students and the alums, honestly, uh, the energy I get from them is uh, it's just palpable and it sort of drives me forward every day. They're so excited to be here. They're so grateful for what Wayne has done for them. It's uh, story after story of coming here and having it be a transformational moment in their lives, like a trajectory altering moment to have come to the law school. And then they go on to do these incredible things and I get to hear about what they're doing and what they plan on doing, and it puts a, a spring in my step and keeps driving me forward. Well, it's nice to have that kind of energy around you. Um, come in, I've been stunned and amazed. Didn't you just have a NATO conference just yesterday? Yeah, and I think that was fantastic. And we've got a bunch more coming up. We've got a, uh, we're doing a conference on criminal justice in partnership with Columbia University in October. Uh, it, there's just, it's hard to keep track of them all. It really yeah, is hard to keep track of the you guys are doing. Just fantastic. Well, so tell me a story about one of these great students that, uh, boy, that you've been working with. Just one. one. Yeah, just one. Okay. Um, so I'll tell you a story about a, a former student. So this is a student who comes to the law school and I think probably around 1997 think she's going to be interested in environmental law, then takes a class in the criminal procedure with Peter Henning, who's one of our fantastic um, criminal law professors, and becomes hooked on that, and then interns at the Wayne County uh, Prosecutor's Office and winds up representing uh, victims of domestic abuse and child abuse, uh, and makes that her career. And so then you fast forward 18 years, she's an expert in that, and she uh, winds up being the lead prosecutor in the Larry Nasser case. Wow. And being the person who's instrumental in arranging for 156 of his victims to do victim impact testimony um, and you, you're playing a part in their transformation, as she put it, from uh, victim to survivor uh, and having this incredible uh, effect on their lives and now she's uh, a member of a governor appointed commission really coming up with solutions to prevent that kind of thing from happening to prevent uh, sexual assault domestic violence and things like that so um that's angela povolitis is her name i mean she's incredible um but there are literally hundreds of stories like that well and you're you're helping to continue the great legacy it's been here from Folks like Emma Key that have contributed, all of uh, the greats who have uh, right. been here and been connected. That's right. I so appreciate your leadership. Thank you very much. Well, and thanks for the ride. Thanks for cruising with Provo. Yeah. All right. Take all care. Right. Take care.